Welcome to this channel. In this particular tutorial, we would be simulating an current mirror circuit using an NMOS. So this particular circuit is simulated using the LT Spice tool. For more such videos, I request you to like, share and subscribe to my channel below. For this particular circuit simulation, we would require the few set of components for this design. That is, we would require an M1 and M2 NMOS and also we would require certain resistors for this particular circuit design. We would also be using LED which would be used in this particular circuit simulation. So as described earlier, the basic NMOS current mirror is made using the M1 and M2 NMOS. When designing, we assume that the M1 and the M2 have same width and length. Since the MOSFET have same gate source voltages, we expect them to have same drain current for this particular circuit simulation. So as you can see, I'm designing this particular circuit. We require certain set of components such as the two resistors which are used in our design across the drains of M1 and M2 are equal. The drain of M2 will be the same potential as of the drain of M1. So by matching the size, the, vol the voltage across the gate and source and the drain current of true transistor, we assume that the two MOSFET has the same drain source voltage. So you can see this particular calculation which I have done for your reference purpose. So you can see this particular calculation and the overall the resistor for this particular circuit is required is a around 200 kilo ohm so how do we determine the value of r for this particular circuit we assume that the drain current is approximately 20 micro ampere now when we design this particular circuit we determine that the I reference is equal to 20 micro amperes. So based on the calculation, we calculate that the resistor required for this particular circuit is around 200 kilo ohm as shown in this particular tutorial. Now, once we simulate this particular simulation by clicking on this run button, the simulation of NMOS current mirror can be seen. The reference current is not exactly 20 microamperes. The x-axis is a sweep of the voltage across the current source. We can also observe that the voltage across the drain source of M2 triodes and the output current IO goes to zero which means that the I reference and the voltage across the gate source are not dependent on the VO. Thank you for watching this tutorial. I hope this has helped your learning purpose. I request you to like, share 
and subscribe my channel below.